Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of NCAA 14 Road to Glory. Quarterback Trevor Martin here, and today we are not playing Week 6 against Bartlett. At the end of the last video, I gave you guys an option of what you wanted to skip ahead to. If you wanted to skip to the playoffs or to signing day, and it was very, very close by a difference of about 10 votes, at least from when I checked. People wanted to skip to signing day, so that's what we're doing. We're going to skip all the remaining high school games and not have another opportunity to play them. That's okay, because high school... It doesn't really matter. The whole point of the series is kind of our college career and, and moving up the ranks and stuff. So anyway, here we go. Signing day. Let's go to signing day. Who should we go with? Well, again, I gave you guys this option, and I let you guys choose, like, probably two episodes ago. And I told you guys that I was kind of leaning towards Iowa. A, because... My girlfriend's going to be going to school there, but also B, just because, you know, they're a good team, but they're not an absolutely amazing team. They have some room for improvement, and I thought that would be fun to try to uh, move up the uh, the ranks there. But you guys were not having that. There were some Iowa fans. Thank you to you guys. But uh, the top two were Miami and Oregon. There you go. For some reason, I couldn't see Oregon there. But yeah, it was between Miami and Oregon. Another very, very, very close matchup. But a winning by about 20, maybe 20 votes or so, 20 comments was Oregon. So we're going to go with Oregon. Here we go. Choose our jersey number. Uh, well, we're a quarterback, so we got to stay low. I'm feeling, I'm feeling number 10. That feels like a quarterback, uh, a quarterback number. Our official spark rating is 105. And I think it said we're going to be a third string quarterback on Oregon. So that's, uh... That's definitely not where we're going to end up being at the end of the season, that's for sure. So we packed our bags. We are currently driving to the school. AKA, this game is taking forever to load. Ooh, we're getting settled on campus. And here we go. Week 1, 2013. Coach Trust. Depending on how well you perform, you will gain and lose Coach Trust points. Earn enough points, you will get to challenge the next man in the depth chart and also gain new abilities. Cool. So we're currently third string. We can move up to second string starter, veteran starter, team captain, hometown hero, team leader, field general, household name, player coach, and team legend. So obviously the goal is to get to team legend. So we currently have zero out of 200 points in coach trust to move up to, uh, to that second string spot. But let's go ahead and practice. I have a feeling this is going to help us gain trust. So play well, earn trust, and we'll get more actual playing time on the field. Here we go. All right. Wow, this is an epic field. Trevor Martin, opponent's scouting report, blah, blah, blah. I don't think this matters. Um, let's just go ahead and do this. All right, we're running a slant pass play. Let's see what we can do. Nice. All right, next up is quick slants. As you can see down the bottom right, we've got... Uh, We've got a bunch of reps. We've got 23 left at this point. That guy dropped the ball. I'm not happy with him. There it is. Threaded that one in there. That was a, a risky pass, but that's okay. All right, back to the slants play. It seems like we're kind of focusing on quick slants in this one. Ooh, look at that. That's why I played for freaking Oregon. That was not a ball that anybody should have ever caught, but that's okay. We're Oregon, baby. Nice. Keep that in bounds. What a great play. This is much better than I was used to at my high school and on my online dynasty. Oh, hit as I was throwing. That's not good. As you can see, we're also gaining XP down the bottom left, so that's pretty cool. Wide open. Slant right across the midfield. That's my favorite play to throw. 
Next up, Z spot. Hitting that Z spot, baby. Here we go. Go ahead and dump it off to the running back there. Quick and easy little gain. I really want to get some touchdowns, man. Ooh. Wish he would have hung onto that one. Nice. So for those of you that have played this before, because I haven't played this in a really long time, is the goal to try to get scores or just like a bunch of quick completions and and move the ball upfield? I'm sure scores are important, but should I be calling hot routes and throwing it deep or what? This is an epic field. Is this real? The Nike Spark training field? If this was a real place, that'd be insane. Woo! That was a good play. Let's see if we can't hit Y for a touchdown here. That'd be awesome. Oh, interception. That's not going to help me. I just wanted to go for the TD. All right. We'll play it safe from here on out. Oh, sacked. That's two bad plays in a row. That's definitely not what we want. Get our composure back. Here we go. Two out of 25 is not too bad. Screen pass to X. Ooh. Oh, what the heck is this? I didn't like that play call at all. All right, let's see what we can do here. I'm rolling out right. I'm going to hit B in the touchdown. No, I'm not. He was in double coverage. All right, so the second half of this practice has not been very strong. Shit! So I was trying to throw that to X, but I was hit as I was throwing, and it threw short. X was open. That might have been a touchdown there. There we go. That's a better play. Come on, these last three... Let's uh, let's like make up for a lackluster performance. Oh, come on! X keeps getting open, but my O line won't hold him. Ah, catch that ball, dog! All right, there we go. That's practice for this week. Coach Feedback, you're doing well. Next week, you can challenge the next string. Sweet! All right, so after the first practice, he's already telling me I can challenge second string. So we've practiced. Let's check out everything else we can do. My skills. I'm an 81 overall. That's not too bad. We can definitely, definitely move that up, though. Skill upgrades. Read and react. Um, how, how am I purchasing these? Like, oh, I've got 8,640 points. Chick magnet. Chicks dig the long ball, especially in this throw power boost. Ooh. I like throw power boosts. Acceleration and carrying boost. Don't vent. Just grab the strength, importance, and stamina boost. Hmm. That's looking pretty good. I want to save for this triple check upgrade, so we'll save for that. Um, there we go. Let's go ahead and play our game. wonder if they're going to put us in. Hopefully, oh, wow. We're playing a 63 overall, so I've got a feeling we might get some PT. Let's check it out. All right, guys, welcome back. Here we go. Our first college game. Hopefully, we can get some uh, 
get some playing time. We're currently the third string quarterback. But what? But we'll see if we can't uh, can't get anything done. So we're just going to go ahead and sim until we're on the field. Looks like Oregon is ranked six. We take a quick 7-0 lead. Ooh, FCSSE ties it up. It's 7-7. Ooh, there we go. Oh, two quick touchdowns in a row. Three in a row. Four in a row. Come on, coach. Put me in. It's 41-7. Put me in, coach, please. Okay. So uh, I didn't do anything. But we won the game like 40, yeah, 41 to 14. That's rough. All right. So first game, we did not get any playing time. That's unfortunate. But I think if we have another good practice, we'll be able to challenge second string this next week. So that should be pretty cool. And if we actually earn the second string spot, then we'll probably be able to get some playing time if we get another blowout like that. So let's see. Let's see if we can't do that. Go ahead and advance a week. All events prior to this point will be simulated. Advance to week two. I believe we, uh, I believe we're all good. In terms of stuff we can do. What's legend score? Looks like that's just like achievements and stuff. One thing I do want to check is can we upgrade? Do we have 8,000 yet? No, we don't. Is this only something we can upgrade every, like in week one? Or are they going to change when you go to week two or what? Let's find out. Let's go ahead and advance a week. Come on. 41 to 14. That was a crazy blowout, man. Come on. Week two at UVA. University of Virginia. Here we go. Uh-oh. Looks like we got a position battle on our hands. To earn second string. Should be exciting. Here we go, guys. Okay, here we go. Position battle against L. Jackson. I'm not exactly sure what we need to do in order to win this position battle, but I guess we're about to find out. Ah, he dropped that damn ball. It'd be cool if you, like, could watch the other guy play his play and, like, you guys just go back and forth and see who can get the most yards and stuff like that. Oh, we just have to get 1,000 points, and that was 200 out of 1,000. Is this serious? It's really that easy? Oh, shit. Bad pass. I'm not liking this play. Nice. 230 points with that reception. Oh, hang on to the ball, man. This is a position battle. It's on both of us if I don't get this. 10 reps left. Oh, man. This actually might be... Uh, this might be kind of difficult. That count? Yes! Woo! That gave us a lot of points. Okay, here we go. Shit. Do we lose points? No. We just don't gain any. All right, we need 307 plays. Ooh, that's not good. Interception. Oh, man, this is so close. Going for a deep ball with X. Oh, God, Trev, you're making bad decisions here, buddy. Just play the game like you would normally play. Don't think about the numbers at the bottom of the screen. There you go. Come on, give me some yards. Woo! All right, we basically need one more reception, and we're good to go. P 
Position battle one. Hell yeah. All right, now let's throw freaking touchdown bombs. Here we go. Or interception bombs. I don't care. I just want to get a touchdown, man. All right, we're hitting Y. Come on. Come down with it. Ah. There we go. We are now number two on the depth chart. Still probably won't get any playing time, though. We'll see. Go ahead and play this game against UVA. Ooh, it's a 95 versus an 84. That's actually not very good. Because if it's not a blowout game, I definitely won't get in. But whatever, we'll see. Hopefully we can make it in our second game. If not, we'll battle it out in practice. Try to earn enough coach trust. And then if we can do that, we'll be able to take on the first, first guy in the depth chart. And if we do that, then we're good to go. We'll be the starter. Start making ourselves a household name and a legend. Here we go. At UVA. See if we can't get in this game. Wow. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was getting in already, but no, I'm just in to, uh, to snap the damn ball. Cool! Just touched my first college football in an actual game. Woo! Score! Swag! Did you see how good he held that? Oh, God. Another one. Now every time I get on the field, I'm going to be all excited thinking I'm about to play, but it's just going to be me holding the goddamn ball. Ah! This is frustrating. All right, 17-0. to Time to put the backup in, ain't it? Jeez, man. This is... Ooh. Hopefully he can make this. It's a pretty deep one. Nice. Send it right through those uprights. All right. Let's do like a fake field goal pass or something at least. Come on, coach. Put me in. I'm ready to play. Oh, I got in to do a kneel. Can I audible? Damn it. This is awesome, though. At least I'm on the field. Please don't fumble the ball. Please don't mess anything up, Trevor. Thank you. And don't get hurt. Coach, let me throw the ball. Come on. God. Another nice kick. And that's going to be the end of the game. All right. So in game two, we didn't do anything. <laughs> Just like in game one. But I've got a feeling this all may change in game three. Let's go ahead and advance to week three. We'll do the practice of that week. See how much coach trust we gain. And that'll probably be the end of the episode. So uh, as you guys know, this episode probably a little bit more boring than most since we actually, you know, didn't get any game time. But that's, oh, wait, hold on, cancel. We gotta buy some skill upgrades. Hold on. Shit. What do we wanna do here? Acceleration, agility, and carrying boost, absolutely. Throw accuracy boost. Throw power and throw accuracy. Uh, trucking and strength, that's cool. Acceleration and carrying boost. We don't have enough for that. Shoot. All right. Nope. No, I don't want to exit. Okay. Now let's go ahead and advance to the next week. But yeah, as I was saying, this episode, probably not the most interesting, but 
you got to put in the groundwork to uh, to start for Oregon, that's for sure. So I'm sure next episode will be a little bit better. Hopefully we get some game time and hopefully we can win that starting position battle or at least get to it. Oh, we're playing Tennessee in week three. That's going to be a tough game. That'd be awesome if we could get some PT in that, but I'm sure we won't. Check out our coach, Trust. We've got 10 points towards starter. Let's go to practice. We need to get some freaking TDs in this thing. I have a feeling that'll boost us up a lot. We also need completions. So we'll see. Here we go. Back in practice. More of these damn quick slants. I'm not going to move the ball downfield with these things, asshole. Whoever's calling the plays. Rolling right, hitting RB. No, I'm not. I'm hitting B. He's wide open. Oh, interception. That's not good. At least the interceptions don't, like, super hurt you in this. They just kind of waste that rep, but that's okay with me. Ooh, that looked like a broken arm. Oh, I want to hit B so bad. Damn it. He's just about to be open. My freaking O-line does not hold for shit. Oh, come on. That was just a bad pass. Take it! Oh, we were so close! Nice. Go ahead and throw that one away. Ooh, I'm hitting A for sure. God, I just wanted to break that tackle and get in the end zone. I want to know what happens if you get a touchdown. Damn it. Close. Alright, try this again. God. Red two. Orange three. Go. Who's open? I don't see anybody open. I just had to throw an interception there. There's literally nobody open. All right, we're going to hit B. Oh, hang on to the ball, man. B. Oh. Screenplay. Covered. Jeez, this has been like the worst 10 plays of my life. Another interception. We are definitely not getting a spot to challenge next game. Or next week. Another interception. Wow, this is crazy. All right, I'm just going for TDs. That's the only thing that can save us now. Damn it. Black five, black out. <laughs> Throwing into like five man coverage. Best QB ever. Oh, dude. Get the damn block. I could have taken that one. And he just runs right out of bounds. Okay. 
Keep working and soon you'll be able to challenge the next string. So it sounds like after one more practice, we'll be able to challenge the next string. So we'll be able to play in probably two weeks. So uh, anyway, thank you all for watching. We'll see you guys in the next episode of this where hopefully we can get some playtime. Peace out, guys.